box read. All right, so we're crowing at a B flat. Very sharp B flat, very flat B natural. So I'm gonna say B natural because that's closer to where we wanna be, but about 50 cents flat. This is definitely more, um, just from the crow I'm feeling, this is definitely more open than most of the reads that we've looked at so far. So I'm thinking that um, there might be a little more resistance than a beginner would want. Okay, so not nearly as much resistance as I thought, but I can feel that the reed is pretty open. The tip is kind of thick because it it just feels bigger in my mouth. Um, it's not as hard to play, but it might be difficult to keep in tune. So let's find out how the how the intonation is on this read. Okay, I would say about 15 cents flat on that A. Not not as flat as I expected just by um, what I'm feeling when I'm playing. High A is right in tune. D is about 20 cents flat. Okay, middle D is about 10 cents flat, so we're coming more in tune as we go up the scale. High D. High D is right in tune, which is pretty surprising. Natural F. That's about 30 cents flat. Forked F. About 35 cents flat. We usually, unfortunately, forked F is a little bit flatter than the other two fingerings, but we don't really want to be that flat. Left F. Okay, so left F is about 15 cents flat, but the beginners probably don't have a left F, so we don't really want to rely on using that fingering all the time. C scale. So none of those notes were sharp. Um, as we climbed the scale, we did get closer to being in tune and several of the notes were in tune. Some of the lower notes were pretty flat and F is also pretty flat. So I'm gonna make a note of that. that would make me get tired easily because even though it's not super hard to blow it is resistant enough that I feel like I need to control it with my embouchure
playing more lengthy things. Um, I definitely am feeling that resistance and feeling that pressure kind of in my throat, especially in Scarborough Fair. I do find myself needing to take a breath, breathe in, breathe out more often than some of these other reads. So this is actually pretty similar in resistance to the forest read. I think the forest is probably a little bit more resistant, a little bit harder to play and control, but this is a close second to that. So um, this is a 69 millimeter read. So I mean, <laughs> it's 69 millimeters and it's pretty flat. And the forest one was 70 millimeters and it was pretty sharp. So that isn't always an indication of how the read is going to respond. And obviously the read might respond differently for different students. This one though, I would definitely adjust and looking at it in the light, I would probably thin the tip out on this one because that feels thicker to me in my mouth than, than some of these other reads. So I'd probably thin the tip um, and that might be enough. But just as it is, this might be a, a difficult, a more difficult read for a beginner to play. So this is the fox. This is the fox read. Mm -hmm.